Today we're going to just talk about 2019 planners. I'm really excited to announce that all of the 2019 planners are done and available in the shop right now for you to purchase, or if you purchased them in the past, you can go back in and re-download them and you'll see the new updated files. Hi everyone, I'm Lisa from Pretty Fabulous and I help online businesses create beautiful digital downloads using Adobe InDesign. So if this sounds like you or something you might be interested in, make sure to hit the subscribe button below. I post new videos every Monday and Thursday and I do unboxings on Saturday. So the website is back up. I'm so excited, you don't even know. Um, so once you get here, I'll show you how to purchase a template first and then I'll show you how to access your purchase as well as what's different. So the first thing is you're going to go ahead and click on shop and inside here, you'll see all the courses that are available to enroll in, as well as all of the templates you can purchase. Now, everything has been updated for 2019, and the greatest part about buying anything from me is that any updates, you just have it for life. So, you know, if you purchase any of these last year, you're automatically getting 2019. You don't have to do anything extra. Next year, 2020, you'll get those. Plus, if I add more designs or layouts, you get those as well. There is no increase in price for you or maintenance fee. It's just one price for life. And, you know, the thing is, prices are going up. So, for example, example the weekly layout price is increasing this Saturday. But if you purchase it right now, not only will you be grandfathered into the lower price, but I am doing a special live uh, webinar this Saturday just for everybody who has purchased um, the weekly layout. And in that webinar, I will show you exactly how to update this template, how to upload your own logo, how to add your own fonts, how to add your own um colors, anything else that you want to change inside here, any questions that you have for me, I'm yours for the whole hour. Now, the other thing too is when you are inside these, um, you are going to see, let me show you the academics. We'll show that as a, how to access that. But once you hit the purchase, it will take you to Thinkific. And if you ever want to access your purchase, you just go up here to the top right where it says login, and that will take you to my Thinkific platform where you can access all of your courses and your purchases, including webinars, I should mention that too, even though those aren't listed for sale. Um, so in here, if you're wondering if you want to purchase something, I pretty much have tried to give you a screenshot of every single page um, and the covers so you can see exactly what you're getting. And if you're wondering what the fonts are, you get all of that too with your purchase. So let's go ahead and go into the Thinkific site. So once you're in Thinkific, um, and let me just go over here. So you're in this welcome orientation section, then you have the InDesign template section and what's next. So in here you have, I guess, mini lessons, or I, I think they call them chapters inside of here, but you can see the future webinar schedule. For example, I just post that, it's just a FYI. Uh, and as you can see, I have September scheduled, which is how to start your own sticker shop. And I have October scheduled, which is Calligraphy 101, a step-by-step -step workshop for beginners. And again, these web webinars are 100% free, uh, but you just have to remember to attend. And if you are worried that you're going to forget, all you have to do is click the Follow Me on Crowdcast button, and you'll be taken to my Crowdcast, and then you can just click Follow, and it will prompt you. I think it will prompt you. I don't know. I'm not actually a follower of anyone, but then you can see any upcoming events, which clearly I haven't updated that, but I will. Um, and then you can also see any, um, if I go decide to go live on Crowdcast, you'll get a little alert so you can jump join in. Now, back to your academic planner. So once you're inside here, you'll get this about this template section where I basically just copy all of the information that you saw over here on the sales page. And then once we go down here, this is new. This is the README. So the README is actually a, a PDF. And inside of here, you can download this PDF. So don't worry, you don't have to view it 100% on, um, on the Thinkific site but you can download it. It's going to tell you all the steps you need to do to access it. These obviously work if you want to use this. Um, then it's going to tell you how to edit your template and it's going to tell you um, where to go if you want to learn more about planners. And then finally over here, you get two other bonus pages which are related videos. And I know a lot of people say, give people what they want, not what they need. This is actually the opposite. I'm giving you what I think you need to edit these templates. These videos probably aren't my most popular because they're so technical, like you don't 
need them unless you specifically are looking like the first one, how to install fonts on a Mac. So if you don't know, it's going to walk you through that, I think, in like two minutes, um, how to resize your pages in InDesign. So these are things that I think you'll need as you are working through the template in order to create a um, sellable item for your shop. Uh, and then over here, just a free Planner 101 course if you want to enroll in that. So how do you ac actually access your templates? So over here under InDesign templates, um, you are going to go to 2017 and 2018 if you want last year's, and you can just click download. I put those all together in a zip file. Same thing over here, the 2018 and 2019. You can go ahead and download those right away. And then here I made a little note for you about the new font. So there is a font listed already in the old version. So you will want to download that so you can see the font sheet. Um, but I did add one new font for 2019, and that is just Think Pink. Think Pink and there's a link there on where to purchase it. So you'll see all of the font information too, as well, and all of the different uh, purchases and InDesign templates that you have um, that you have bought. So let me know if you have any questions. Otherwise, I hope that I have made this much more user friendly for you and easier. And I hope to see you in this Saturday's webinar uh, so that we can start customizing your weekly planner. And again, weekly, I say the weekly because that's honestly, that's my number one bestseller. It's pretty much, I would say, everyone's bestseller in terms of people who have planner shops. It's just by far the most popular layout. So I hope everyone's having a great week. And if you have any questions about products, let me know down in the comments and I will be happy to answer them. All right, I'll see you guys later. Bye.